the sun. It provides light, warmth, and enables life on Earth. It can also create a brighter future. We came all the way to the eastern provinces to learn more about PRESD SL, which stands for promoting renewable energy services for social development here in Sierra Leone. This EU-funded project lasted for four years and has greatly contributed to alleviating poverty by improving energy access. We are the first people who started using this heat here. It's about four years ago. This is a private business. When people give me contract, they depend on the, on the power that I have. Previously, when the machine gets shut down, there's no way for me to work again. That's the only way I can be able to grow up my business. From, from, from the lower level to higher level, I decide my life to be useful, not on, useful on another we say life. Solar power is clean. It's becoming more affordable. And most importantly, it brings freedom and opportunity to the people. Over 100 solar community charging stations have been installed throughout the country. These charging stations have improved living conditions by providing energy access in remote areas. They have also increased economic revenues by creating over 200 jobs. The Presti project also provides electricity to public facilities like hospitals and schools. The Handmaid's Catholic Maternity Clinic at Pendenbu was created to improve the healthcare system and decrease the long distances patients previously had to travel to get medical care. I know some villages you can go out and sensitize them. Whenever they experience any fever or headache, like malaria, let them come to the health center. Not only when you are sick, but you have to visit the health center frequently so that you know your health status. Installing solar energy has greatly improved the quality of health care provided here at the clinic, and it allows the health center to operate 24 hours a day. Just beyond the clinic, there is a boarding school for girls that has also benefited from the installation of solar energy. It has been really helping me because like for us, in the nights are midnight, we get up for studies, the solar light is there, so we do not go astray for studies. In the afternoon, we use it in the morning. We use it for prayer before going to school. We use the light so we can see our food and eat it. Even if we use it for study in the morning before going to school. So it helps us a lot. And thanks to the introduction of solar energy, when the sun is gone, life can continue. Three chiefdom level community mini grids supply and maintain the solar power. I benefited from the project. In 2016, 17, 18, I went through so many trainings, both in and out of the country, as a training of trainers. I'm a student from Eastern Polytechnic. I graduated two years ago, and my president let me in to come to this organization to work for them. They have made me now to understand more about solar system, so I'm very grateful about that. At least 20 lecturers and 200 students have been trained to sustain renewable energy sector in Sierra Leone. You need people who can take care of them. It's not all the time you bring people from out. Now we have Sierra Leoneans who are trained and qualified and are doing this job. They are doing the installation and looking after the systems. 